Mm. I forgot to open my beer. <clears throat> anyway, my beer's open. I'm drinking, I mean my tea. Okay, this is the the Build Your Own Neverland tag, and I was tagged by Dane Cobain over at Dane Reads. Thank you, Dane, for the tag. Um, one thing I noticed when Dane did this is uh, it's question number one, and I was like, oh, that's going to be a challenge. So here we go. <clears throat> the Build Your Own Neverland tag. Number one, the Jolly Roger. Who's the villain? So Dane selected Randall Flagg, who was who's actually made two appearances in Stephen King novels. The first one, of course, being in The Stand, which I think came out in 78. Randall Flagg was the walking dude, and then he made an appearance in The Eyes of the Dragon. I want to say he was the evil wizard. Been a while since I ran through that one. So... I was like, well, Dane, I'm going to have some problems trying to outdo that. So I went with AM from I Have No Mouth and I Must Scream. And AM stands for Allied Master Computer. And then later on, Adaptive Manipulator. And it decides to keep this handful of human beings in the machine for, well, I think when this takes off, it's been a hundred and some years. And just to torment them because it hates humanity so this machine's entire existence after they've destroyed the world centers around just tormenting what humans are left so I'm gonna go with AM because you know even though it's a computer it's it's pretty freaking evil number two Mermaid's Lagoon who are the lovely ladies hanging out in your beach I'm gonna go with the Viking women from Eaters of the Dead by Michael Crichton because they're Vikings, they're female. Um, number three, Indian Encampment. Who are your allies? Uh, easy choice. The fur cots from Midworld because you get a pack of them on your side, there isn't much to fear. Number four, Lost Boys Treehouse. Who who's your crew? I'm gonna go with uh, the Nightbreed from uh, Clive Barker's novel Cabal. Uh, the Nightbreed are. There's a lot of possibilities with the Nightbreed. Um, they're pretty much reanimated. Um, uh, they hang out at the necropolis, and but they take on various forms, and the forms are really awesome and cool. So uh, they'd be pretty, pretty badass. Uh, okay, number five, Skull Rock. What's the scariest place on the island? The bad place, Dean Koontz, because you'd have to journey to the bad place to understand. It's not somewhere where you want to, you know, hang out. Uh, Smoke a cigarette, drink a beer, you know, have some takeout. Pixie Hollow. Who are your magical helpers? I went with one. I'm going to go with John Tom from the Spellsinger series. Jonathan Merriweather Thomas, I think, was the Spellsinger's name. And he was the wannabe rock and roll guy who liked to smoke weed and try to play the guitar. He wasn't great to begin with, and he got sucked into this world by Clotha Hump, the, the tortoise who was the wizard, and it just kind of goes from there. But when John Tom got good at what he was doing, you better watch out. Number seven, come with me where, where dreams are born, tag people. Now this is going to get out of hand because I always feel bad if I leave people out. And I know you can't tag everyone even though that's what you want to do. So I just listed a bunch of people down here. If you've done it, don't sweat it. 
but it, you know, these are the people I tag. Graham Quigley, Joshana C, Arctech Vlogs, Elena Macredina, um, Jenna over at BiblioFilth, uh, Jazz over at Shiny Things Reviews, hang on, I ain't done yet, Leon over at Paperback Mania, uh, Weena Wonders, Weena, Ryan, Madman Reads and Rocks, <laughs> Melissa and Barnsey, um, Beth over at Read Remark, Lisa at West Coast Reads, I'm serious, I have all these down here, uh, Mad Mystical Monk, uh, Mindy, know who you are, Mindy, um, and Laura at Crying About Books, and I want to say there was somebody else, dang it. Yeah, Kara at Wild Book Reads. And if, you know, if you've done this, don't sweat it. But if you haven't, I'd like to hear about your Neverland. Thanks for watching, and uh, bye.